Why does nasal congestion seem to switch from one nostril to the other when I have a cold? So, have you noticed that when you get a cold, one nostril is blocked while the other one is runny and a few hours later it's the other way around? This is because of a natural phenomenon called the nasal cycle. So, on the inside of our noses, we have these bony shelves covered with soft tissues and mucous membranes called the nasal turbinates. These nasal turbinates help regulate the flow of air and filter out air particles. These can also swell and shrink alternatively in each nostril, resulting in the nasal cycle. So, for example, if your right nostril has increased blood flow, resulting in slight congestion, the other one will open up for easier breathing with a much smaller amount of air passing through the right one. Every few hours, your autonomic nervous system, which is the part of your nervous system that takes care of your heart rate, digestion, and other things you don't consciously control, switches things up and your left nostril now receives increased blood flow and becomes congested while the right one does all the heavy lifting for a little while. This is because a constant airflow can dry out the nostrils and damage their lining, so giving each nostril some rest helps prevent this from happening. So normally, you're not even aware of the nasal cycle happening, but when you have a cold or allergies, your nasal tissues become inflamed due to an immune response. The blood vessels in the lining of your nose dilate resulting in exacerbated congestion and you produce more mucus as well. Now, because of the already existing nasal cycle, the side that's naturally more swollen during that part of the cycle gets way more stuffy. So, even though both nostrils are affected by the cold, the alternating blockage is just your nasal cycle working in overdrive on top of all that inflammation.